Hello, this is Romualdo, and today we're going to be looking at a form finding tutorial for a 20 point facade. Uh, this uh, tutorial is done in Rhinoceros 5. We're going to be using the plugins Grasshopper and Kangaroo. Kangaroo is a, flat, is a physics simulator plugin that we're going to be using for form finding. <clears throat> this is created by Daniel Picker. First thing we're going to start doing is uh, as I did before, uh, I create these uh, boxes, pretending that this is a building. So what we're going to do is that we're going to create a, a membrane structure over these three buildings. And I did create also the mesh. I did a mesh 40 by 40 this, this time because you have more details. And I also create 20 points that I'm going to be eventually moving and attaching to the red anchor points here okay so the first thing that we're going to be doing oh excuse me so also we have some some uh, flying mast that we're going to be using as you see here and some normal mast and then i did leave some opens at the mesh so we can do some inverted eye loops okay you will see that eventually so let's begin by applying assign the mesh to the icon mesh in grasshopper panel and then we need to assign the points press enter i have to turn on the physics simulator by kangaroo once it is on as you see i'm going to turn off the the mesh so i don't get too much confusing here okay once i get the the mesh i can start working and moving around all the points uh, let me click point here okay what i'm going to be doing is that i'm going to be moving all the points to the desired anchor points that i created before in order to start making my membrane structure As you see, it already looks like a uh, membrane structure or the, or the beginning of the membrane structure. We're going to fix this, this anchor point after we finish it with the form finding method. What I am doing is hitting at the keyboard the letter M so I can just move these points around as you see. This is going to be <clears throat> a fly mast here. Also, I need to want to create another fly mast in this point. And then move uh, this point to this anchor point and this one point to the next anchor point these are going to be my inverted eye loop looks like a conical eye loop okay once i have the form finding i can start looking around and see if this form finding works for me and this is what i want for example here you can see that the mesh is going through the building so I have to modify I can always modify whatever I want in any anchor point remember that this is an example just for presentations this is not to, uh, to make an, an analysis of the membrane or the material okay and always 
you have to look at the principles of form finding in chapter one of the book membrane structure steps towards form finding to make sure that everything that you're doing is right concerning membrane structures okay once you decide that this is a final form finding that you want to have you can always click here bake and then you see that you already have your form finding done you see your two i loop inverted where this is this can be can be used for water drainage also you can see two fly mast and then a lot of anchor points attached to the s16 of the building okay once you decide that this is a final one you just click and bake it so you can use it as your presentations in rhinoceros or you can just do renderings of your final form finding remember that you can find more information in membranasestructurales.com if you need uh, me to send you the grasshopper routine or the algorithm you can send me an email lecture at membranestructurales.com remember to look at the chapter one principles of form finding anticlastic and synclastic surface basic forms structural principles uh, i have like 40 examples of form findings in this chapter so you can see how they was they were done also remember that all my tutorials are based on the membrane structure first steps to our form finding book